The Veterinary and Livestock Services Division of the Ministry of Agriculture, in recognizing the increase in the cost of feed, gas, labor and building materials, acknowledges the plight of the swine producers and the need for an increase in the price paid for pork. While the Agriculture Ministry does not regulate the price of pork, Chief of Veterinary Officer Dr. Sharmin Melville Edwin explains that efforts are being made by the Veterinary and Livestock Services Division to validate the cost of production that has been prepared by the Pig Farmers Cooperative Society Limited. So we are aware that the farmers are facing challenges in terms of um, profitability in production. Um, however, we want to state that the price of our livestock commodities including pork. Uh, these are not price controlled items. The Ministry of Agriculture does not regulate the price of pork. Um, we have worked with the Pig Farmers Cooperative. Um, they have presently prepared a cost of production and we have worked with them uh, to try to validate that cost of production. Uh, that validation process has not been finalized as yet and um, uh, but we are working to see how we can uh, smooth that out as quickly as possible. Dr. Melville Edwin also explains that as the Christmas holidays approaches, the Ministry of Agriculture is increasing its monitoring and surveillance of butchery practices to ensure compliance with public health guidelines and procedures. We want the public to remember to practice um, food safety, to ensure that what you're purchasing has been inspected by the Ministry of Agriculture as well as the Ministry of Health. Look out for the stamps of the inspectors and ensure that what you're purchasing um, is healthy meat, quality meat, and of course has gone through the inspection process. Dr. Melville Edwin encourages butchers and the general public to follow the Ministry of Health and Agriculture's public health guidelines and procedures as the Agriculture Ministry works towards a safer and more efficient agriculture sector. From the Communications Unit of the Ministry of Agriculture, I am Anicia Antoine reporting.